Hello everyone, my name is Venusian Clypey and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I have uploaded the 56th video onto my YouTube channel. And today we are going to be painting mountains, which I think are pretty neat. And today's palette, we are going to be using that lovely dark brown color. And... We are just going to be using that to, like, carve out, like, the base of our mountains. Just so we can have, like, a good deep shade that we can work with and add lights to later, if that makes sense. So, yeah. Also, um, in... Last week's video, I forgot to mention that our, well, my YouTube channel surpassed 1,000 views, like, in total, and I think that's pretty neat, considering that there uh, were only, like, 54 videos to, like, choose from, and all of them had... You know, that 1,000 views, like, accumulated together. And hopefully I can branch out and do more. Like, making shorts. Well, short-form content. And I already have, like, a game plan. Because that's, like, one reason why I am recording in bulk. If my voice sounds a little hoarse, it's because... My cat, Franchise. Sorry if I got cut off mid-recording. My cat got on the MacBook again. And kind of... Um... How do I explain it? Nothing bad happened. It's just she stepped, like, near the computer and took a screenshot of GarageBand. So now I am keeping her occupied by playing with her with a string fish. I wish I could explain it better, but it's like a stick and a string and a little fish. So hopefully she will not be as tempted to step on my keyboard and delete files like she did the time before the last time. And yeah, I had to re- I am re-recording a lot of that audio. Which is probably a good thing now that I think about it, but god. I am definitely going to need some, like, honey tea tomorrow or something. Because, man, I'm my throat is dry. But, yeah. I am kind of recording in bulk at the moment, so I can have enough time to, like, make short-form content for my channel. And you know what? I'm okay with that. I'm okay if I have to, like, branch out and try new things. It's okay to, to, like, take risks that are, like, calculated. It's kind of like I'm like a cat chasing after a fish on a string. But instead of, like, a string, per se, or, like, a fish, I am just chasing after, like, a dream to hopefully eventually move out from where I currently live and find a better place for me. Or somewhere where I feel like I belong. You know. I mean... I know that, like, people often, like, search for, like, themselves when they go to, like, Places like mountains or like hikes. 
But me, I'm just constantly just searching to, like, see which me underneath all these me's is me, if that makes sense. Like, who am I really underneath, like, everything? Does that make sense to y'all? But yeah. I am just trying my best to chase what feels like an impossible dream. But you know what? I know it can be done, and I know I can do it. And you know what? I'm fine. Sometimes I have, like, this, like, unwavering hope that is kind of... I guess naive that even though I've been through like a lot of things and some of them were not so great to put it gently, I still believe in the goodness of people. And mankind, I guess. But yeah. <sighs> Sorry, I've just had like some time to like process like some things that happened to me in August that I will probably not be able to like talk about like publicly like ever or if I do it will be in a book disguised in some way. Well, I say disguise, but, like, made more palpable. Because... I know that there are parts of... Human nature that are generally, like, dark and cruel. And vindictive, at best. But I know that... Good people exist, and there is reason to like hope for the future and to like keep trying I guess it's like all that I really have to like hold on to does that make sense but yeah I have been seeing a therapist about like what happened in August and it will probably take me, like, a while to, like, unpack all of what happened, but, like, God. I am just, I guess, done. Well, I mean, I say done, but, like, I guess I'm, like, over it. Just, well, I say over it, but, like, I'm just over being tired and just constantly, like, second-guessing, like, every step I make and hoping I don't panic because every time I hear a phone call now, I just... I just get scared thinking that it's them coming for me. But God. I guess. I guess I am over it, but at the same time, a lot of it is just me. But I'm in the clear now. I'm mostly safe. I know I'm safe. But sometimes when you've been through, like, events like that, sometimes you can't help but wonder, am I really in the clear now? Is everything safe? And your body just, like, panics by default. Even though you know 
that you should be fine. But yeah. I guess I believe in hope. Also, is it just me or does it look like the camera is like kind of zooming in and out a little bit? Is it just me? Honestly, after this, I am just going to like take a nap and like maybe get some sleep. And I am just like standing back and looking at the painting like we are right now. If you like this video, thank you so much. And if you want to see more content like this, um, please subscribe. I have videos every Monday at 10 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. Also, please ring that notification bell. Thank you. It means a lot. Bye. For real.